Good afternoon, Aiken. My name is Michelle A. Jackson, and I'm here to bring you the front page. In our leading local stories, dueling on the diamond. The Midland Valley baseball team defeated South Aiken in a comeback victory that went extra innings last night. The two teams will play again tonight with a top spot in the region standings on the line. In our coroner update, Daryl Abels was sworn in as the Aiken County coroner on Thursday. Abels took over the position after former coroner Tim Carlton passed away. We'll be back after a brief message from our sponsor. Everyone's a welcome guest at Crescent Automotive. We're Aiken's Choice Award winner four years in a row. That probably has a lot to do with our low upfront windshield pricing and no additional processing fees. Remember, everybody drives Crescent. You should too. Lindsey Graham weighs in. U.S. Senator Lindsey Graham expressed his displeasure with the U.S. Department of Energy and its National Nuclear Security Administration during a tense Senate subcommittee hearing. The golf goes on. The inaugural Augusta National Women's Amateur continues at Champions Retreat today. The field will be cut after the second round and the top 30 golfers will advance to play at Augusta National on Saturday. To read more about these stories, please visit AikenStandard.com. I'm your host, Michelle A. Jackson, and I'll see you tomorrow on the front page.